the Maasai village, they use twigs to brush their teeth. So they use twigs from different trees and then they'll shave down the end, take the bark off, and then they fray the end so that there's an end to brush with. And every day you see them doing it in the morning and the evening. They're busy cleaning their teeth and it seems like they're doing it for like about an hour because they kind of like keep it in their mouth and then they keep doing it and then kind of take a break and then they do it some more. So they really do a very deep clean with these and their teeth are so beautiful and so white. Now my western teeth are used to toothbrushes and toothpaste. Fluoride free toothpaste, let me add. I use only natural toothpaste but still my teeth are accustomed to toothbrushes and toothpaste. So I figured since I'm here, I'm going to try doing it the Maasai way for five straight days with using no more of this, just nature. And I love using nature for most things in my life. So this is exciting. I'm interested to see how my teeth do with this, especially by the end of the day when I've eaten all day and then my teeth are dirty. And then I want to see how they feel, you know, just using this. So that's interesting. Right now they feel really smooth. I actually did chip my tooth the other day, which really sucks. So I'm going to have to see a dentist when I get to the city to fix that chip. But I mean, you know what? Say Livy, that's life. Sometimes we chip our teeth, right? So anyway, yeah, I've been going, going at it this morning with this. And sometimes you get like little pieces of wood in your mouth. So you have to like spit. And I've noticed when you're busy doing this, there's a lot of saliva created in your mouth. So you do actually have to spit quite often. And I'm not a big spitter, but using this, you kind of have to spit. So now I am a spitter for the next five days. So yeah, we shall see how this progresses for me but I think it should be good. I mean, judging by their beautiful teeth, I think it's gonna be great. This morning, I subconsciously <laughs> thought about reaching for my toothbrush and toothpaste because that is what I'm so used to doing in the morning. I'm not gonna lie, my teeth feel a little bit fuzzy this morning. Not bad, but just a tiny bit fuzzy. That could just be from a deep sleep though. So, got my Maasai toothbrush and yeah, I'm gonna get going on this. My teeth feel super smooth and super clean. I didn't expect them to feel this good because they did feel a little furry from sleeping. And wow, I'm really, really impressed with how they're feeling so far. The only thing you have to be wary of is, yeah, you can get some wood on your mouth. So if you're gonna be in front of people after you're done brushing, maybe you just wanna make sure that you've gotten all the wood pieces off your face. And I did rinse with a bit of water to get the little wood pieces out of my mouth. But I think brushing your tongue with this takes some getting used to because I'm used to having the toothpaste and the toothbrush so it feels foamy and clean and this feels a little like scrapish but it's very important to brush your tongue so really though day three my teeth are feeling great cows talking away over there they all just came back from grazing so they have a lot to say about what happened during the day so if you hear them chatting behind us, don't mind the cows. It has officially been five days, well actually almost six now because this is the late afternoon of the sixth day that I've been using the natural Maasai toothbrush. And wow, it's been, it's been an adventure, let me tell you. It was pleasantly surprising because I didn't expect my teeth to feel this clean and this smooth. Not only that, I thought probably for sure I was going to get bad breath at some point throughout the week, but not at all. I mean, nothing. And I've been using it to also brush my tongue because even with a toothbrush, it's super important to brush that tongue of yours. And I was worried like maybe my tongue would like look white or something, you know, if you don't brush your tongue, it can look white. So that's just one of my, my pet peeves. I just really like to make sure that my tongue is always brushed. <laughs> using this, everything seems to be great. I have to admit though, I do miss that fresh feeling after I use my natural clove toothpaste. So I definitely miss that. But you know, mixing the two together, I could probably put a little bit of clove toothpaste on the end of my natural Maasai twig toothbrush and 
do use both. Use nature, use my natural glow toothpaste. I think that would be a winning combination. But this is amazing. And this is so much better for the environment than these. 100%. I mean, this is where it's at. We are saving Mother Nature using one twig at a time to brush our teeth. So yeah, I really enjoyed this experience. I'm going to keep using this while I'm here. And maybe even when I'm in Canada, I'll find some Canadian twigs that I can make some natural toothbrushes out of. Another great thing is it didn't even bother the chip on my tooth. I was a little worried with that because I feel like my tooth is a little weak right now since I did chip it. And the chip is bigger in the back than what you see in the front. So I was like, oh, I hope I don't uh, mess up my tooth. But it's still pretty strong. So happy about that.